Hi, this is Juliet here and I wanted to say hi to everyone. Um, I'm having a lovely day out at the West Hay Nature Reserve and it's quite a hot day so I've just uh, stepped into the trees here. It's a really amazing place. I particularly want to say hi to all the people that are arriving today on my trauma skills training. Uh, this is module two that's about to happen. So hi to everyone and I'm really looking forward to seeing you. And uh, I wanted to share uh, how important it is to resource yourself. So uh, resourcing is about giving yourself time out to, to feel better, to feel stronger in your life um, and everything. Something's just come up here. Um, oh, it's confusing with these little messages that pop up, but anyway. I'm getting the hang of how to do this. So I wanted to talk to you a little bit about trauma healing and how important it is. People tend to think that trauma is some bad thing that's happened to you, but trauma isn't that. And it's I'm not talking about trauma as a medical condition um, in the way that hospitals and doctors talk about it. I'm talking about trauma as an effect in the nervous system. So. It's not what has happened to you, it's how your nervous system then responds and copes with what's happened to you. What's happened to you. So trauma is a physiological problem, it's a body problem, it's not a mental health problem. And so the pathway to healing trauma is about actually taking time out and resourcing yourself and um, beginning to create sensory information channeling into your body, into your brain that helps you um, understand that actually in this moment you're not in a dangerous situation but you're in a situation of health and well-being. So when we get activated in, tra in a, a traumatic activation the brain is acting as if we're in imminent danger and that's why we get angry or why we freeze or why we shut down, why we get fr frightened. But if we can give our brain the message that actually, even though I'm triggered, right here, right now, it's just a trigger and I'm not in danger. So this is why coming out to the levels, the Glastonbury levels, is such an amazing thing to do. It's like, it's, a, it's full of sensory stimulation. I've got the, the trees, I can touch um, all sorts of colors around me, all sorts of plants lots of scents, um, the damsel, the blue damsel flies are flitting around everywhere and they're a delight to the heart. Um, I've got lots of water behind me, I don't know if you can see, with, with birds and um, all sorts of water birds, swans and things. So it's really a lovely time to spend and to, uh, to relax. And I've had a bit of a tough year and um, it's been really, really challenging to me. So I just wanted to mention resilience. So it's not about how much is pumped at you and feeling that your life is about to crash. It's about keeping um, yourself resourced and resilience is your possibility to rebound and, and to stay present despite all the, all the challenges. So I can tell you, I have had an extraordinarily difficult year and right now I'm really well and really prepared and ready and resourced to um, take module two of the trauma skills training and it's a delight to me to do that and really looking forward to it and uh, for those of you that are interested in healing trauma and to understand that practically everyone on this planet is suffering from trauma in some way um, I'm offering um, another trauma training next year 2019 and my intro day is in October, on October the 6th, 2019. So email me, info at healing-waters.co.uk and um, get in touch and uh, see how your life can change because this work is really, really amazing. So a big hello to all my friends, all those people out there that I love, all those people that have trained with me in the past. And I'm really, really happy that you've got so much happening for you now as a result of this healing work that you've done and uh, just a final word is that it's not frightening people often avoid doing the trauma healing work because they feel like they're going to have to step into some really black holes and it's not like that 
it's not about going into all the bleakness and the darkness it's about negotiating a pathway through to wellness and health so um and it can be fun so lots of love to you and uh, see everyone for the module two tomorrow okay bye <laughs> bye bye